You sure you're at the right party? This is a celebration for the Saints, is it not? Business with Marshall is less lucrative than it used to be. I was hoping your bosses would be interested in a new partnership. They're in there. I'd knock if I were you. Hello? It's Antonio Espina. <clears throat> Look, I, I know that we don't have the best history, but I was thinking, hoping, really, that we could work something out. Antonio, glad you came to your senses. Hey, I'm kind of having a party right now, but we'll talk business later. We got a party going on, so I'm gonna keep this one short and sweet. Fuck the Panteros. Fuck the idols. Fuck Marshall. The Saints are here to stay, baby. So, if you know how to shoot a gun, or if you're broke and want to learn how, swing by the church. We'll be waiting for you. Hello, 
and welcome to Marshall Defense Industries. We know it wasn't easy getting here. Your journey began with one of the most unforgiving job interviews we could devise. But you did more than just survive a few live fire exercises. You excelled, and in doing so, proved that you were Marshall material. But don't take my word for it. Hear it from the man himself. Hello, I'm Atticus Marshall, and I wanted to personally welcome you to the Marshall family. Here at MDI, we don't just make a problem. We make the world a better place. So how do we do that? With a little TLC. Technologically advanced weapons, loose morals, and a culture of conflict. Now let's take a step through each of those letters. Why are you watching that now? That's the orientation video. I know what it is. Why are you watching it now? Well, I mean, we're about to be shot at, so I figured it couldn't hurt to brush up on our healthcare package. If you weren't paying attention to the briefing, I don't think you'll live long enough for your copay to matter. So I should be reviewing the life insurance policy. You know, our job interview has a 5% mortality rate. Statistically, the odds were low that you would die before we hired you, but I allowed myself to be an optimist. Your parents should have treated you better. Yours should have treated you worse. All right, ladies and gentlemen, contrary to your colleagues' demeanor, this is no laughing matter. The Nawali already took out one team that was sent to bring him in, and I want as many of us going home as possible. So stick to the plan, work together, and let's grab that son of a bitch and send him to the frontier. Let's get paid. Alpha team, go. First day on the job. Don't fuck up. Newbie, catch up. Right. Let's kick some. Holy shit. Turrets, take cover. Ah. That was close. Ah. Ah. Oh. Jesus Christ, it's my first fucking day. Shit. Anybody left? Me, I think. Fix. We have to rendezvous with Bravo team or we're dead. Keep pushing forward, I'll meet you there. Copy that. Welcome to the Daily Grind. Protect the Wally! Getting a little hot out here. Keep pushing forward. Prepare for airstrike. Shit. That helps. Hey, you! We gotta find... Fuck! Better hustle, newbie. Bravo team is ready to move in. I'm not exactly taking a coffee break here. Marshal scum! Oh, bite me. Still alive? You sound like you lost the pool. Fall in. We'll use this APC for cover. A rolling shield. Nice. Now I'm delighted you approve. Bailey, make a hole. Roger that. Now let's go. Through the breach. Go, go, go. Ooh. Ah. Ooh. for outstanding work, if you survive to collect it. Got it. Just trying to understand the pay structure. <laughs> Did you just shoot your CO? I'm out! Oh. Bailey, hold up. Marshal, clear the field. Yes, ma'am. Turn her down! Shit! Whoa, take the turret! I got it. I'm good with these. But that's not... You are damn lucky we don't have time to argue. Uh, Ruby, take out the RPG up top. Good work. Now engage the other. See? Told you I was good with these. Just shut up and shoot. Uh. 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 Now it's so funny when 
You're taking fire, huh? I'm out. Oh. Driver's hit. Bailey, you all right? Bailey? Bailey, get your foot off the gas. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Shit. Either they're all dead or there's no signal. Guess I should push on and find the new Ollie myself. The things we do for rent. Now the Wally wants them all dead! Uh. Intruder! Suspect is quick! How did Marshall get this far? At least I don't have to wear a suit. End of the tunnel. Gwen! Hello, do you read me? Newbie, you're still alive? Yeah, I hear that a lot. The Nawalis hold up in the saloon up ahead. Rendezvous with the rest of us and we can box them in. In a minute. Gonna clear out some goons first. I gave you an order. It's on my way. Besides, we don't want them coming up behind us later. Fine. But next time I give an order, the only words I want to hear are yes and ma'am. Got that? Uh, yes ma'am. You're not gonna hide from me! Ah. Feels good to make an honest living. Get low! Working stiffs too, huh? Little C4 should take out that barricade. Ha! Couldn't do that at my last job. Newbie, over here! Glad you could join us. Let's move! We gotta keep the Nawali hold up until Charlie team arrives. Newbie, once we hit the saloon, you flank left while the rest of us hold the center. Flank? But I can... Yes, ma'am. Saloon's right around this bend. Get ready and remember the plan. All right, team. Let's take it. Get in there and flush that son of a bitch out. Oh, 
what does it take for a man to be able to enjoy a quiet drink these days? Mr. Nawali, you're coming with me. You really think you have what it takes to bring me in? I mean, yeah. Hey, where are you fucking going? I said you're coming with me! Perhaps I don't respect your authority. Then respect this. You set one foot on those stairs. Holy shit! No, you goddamn don't! Give it up, Nawali! There's nowhere to hide! You're surrounded. Make it easy on yourself. I can't find him. Never mind. Get back here and regroup. We've got the bastard bottled up with nowhere to run. We know he's in the saloon. He can't stay in there forever. Fuck. Thanks for the ride. I'll see you around. We need air support now. Stand down. We don't got time for hero bullshit. Don't worry, I got this. Got a problem. Hang on, the cavalry's coming. Oh shit. Come out with your hands up. <laughs> Not today. Brains. God damn right I do. You're too predictable. Am 
am I? Tried. I'll give you that. Get your hands in the air. I caught him. Well, you didn't die. All in all, not a bad start. Jesus Christ! You're not gonna last. Your pep talks need some work. This is for you. Performance bonus. Is this a joke? You, uh, you ribbon the rookie? What were you expecting? There's supposed to be a bonus based on exceptional performance. That's right. And if you had performed exceptionally, you would have seen a bonus. Oh, come on. Can you really look me in the eyes and say I didn't do well? I can look you in the eyes and say you didn't do what you were told. I saw a better way and I took it. And if you were in charge, it would have been an inspired decision. But you're not. I am. This is a warning. Fall in line or find a new job. All in line? What the fuck? No, what the actual fuck? What the actual goddamn fuck? What the actual goddamn motherfucking goddamn fuck? Line. You have three new messages. Hey, it's Kev. I'm baking up a slamming congratulatory brunch for when you get home to celebrate your first day on the job. It's gonna be dope. Oh, and it's official. I'm gonna be spinning at that idols party I told you about, so hope you can come. TTYL. Hey there, it's Nina. So excited about your new gig. I thought you'd want to know. I, I heard back from the museum. Uh, they, they went with someone else for the junior art curator job, so... Looks like I'm still stuck with Los Panteros. Anyway, I'm glad one of us had a good day at least. See you soon. Hey, it's Eli. 
Congrats on your first day as part of the workforce. Speaking of which, um, when you asked to borrow my copy of Be Your Own Boss, I assumed it was because you wanted to read it, not to level out the coffee table. So let's talk about that when you get back. Can't wait to hear about all the HR forms I'm sure you had to sign. Everything smells amazing, Kev. You know what would make it smell even better? Hey, man, if you want a $300 waffle maker, you can buy it with the exposure the idols pay you in. Don't expect us to chip in. I've told you before, the idols are trying to build a post-capitalist society where money is not a concept. Yeah? Then why don't you go run off and join the commune? I'm into showering. Are you going to help me get the waffle maker or not? As an investor, I don't like wasting money. You're wearing a fucking bow tie. <sighs> okay, I will throw in 20 bucks for a waffle maker. Nina? Um, good for 10? Who helped you move your forged paintings last month? Fine, 15. W what sort of waffle maker can I get for 35 bucks? Uh, presumably one that makes fucking waffles. Mm -hmm. Hey! <laughs> hey! The wage slave is back! How was your first day? Were the other mercenaries nice to you? You know, as far as hired killers go, I'd give them a 7. You look like you could use a mugmosa. Thanks, Eli. Seriously, how was the job? Eh, it's the murder business. The fundamentals don't change, just the uniform. I can tell you love it. Okay. I don't have to love it. I have to pay my student loans. Poof. I'm in. So I'm guessing that means the pay's good. Uh, it's supposed to be. Got stiffed on my bonus today. Dude, what the fuck? I uh, played a little fast and loose on the job, and, uh, oh, my CEO wasn't a fan. You gotta be kidding me. Swear to God. This lady walked right off the set of an 80s action movie. I was half expecting her to call me Rook and threaten to take my badge. Are we going to make rent? We'll make rent. We just got to be a little more creative. Last time we got creative, I got stabbed three times. Hey, it would have been four times if Nina and I hadn't shown up. It would have been zero times if you were on time. This is true. Look, this is really not a big deal. We just knock off a payday loan place. No one gives a shit if people rob those bastards. You have a job now. You could actually just take the loan. Eli, I don't do business with morally bankrupt companies. You work for Marshall. Brunch is a time for friends and mimosas, not debates on morality. All right, all right. Man, this is really fucking good, Kev. Thanks. I was worried I added too much pepper. Mm-mm. Mm. No, seriously, this is perfect. The only way this could be better is if you put on a fucking shirt. Dinner and a show, baby. Oh, please. <laughs> <laughs> okay, brunch is done, dishes are clean. Let's go rob a payday loan place. And you know how we should celebrate afterwards. Karaoke! Yes! So, Nina, are we taking your project car? Fuck no, I'm not risking my baby over rent. We're boosting cars from down the street. Ooh! Can we take a hybrid? Eli, I love that you're worried about fuel efficiency, but I'm thinking acceleration is gonna matter more. Your carbon footprint always matters. Just take that yellow one. It's mine now. Kev, you cased the place. What are we looking at? One guard out front, and the owner at the till. He's a real scuzzbag. I want some kicking dog. So, you know, fuck that guy. Almost there. Let's get psyched. But only you oh, can no. decide how Not you this react crap again. To hey, only you the rule. can choose Don't to yuck adapt someone's to the changes yum. that life throws your way. You have more agency and power than the world wants you to know. But to realize that power, there's something you need to do. You need to be your own boss. Be your own boss. That's right. Be your own boss. One of these days, I'm gonna get you to listen to music in the car. 
Roger McGillicuddy speaks the music of my soul. You are a different kind of cat, Eli. What can I say? The world is full of uninteresting people, and I'm not going to be one of them. You got one of those for me? You really want one after last time? I am not the first person to accidentally shoot a friend by dropping a loaded... Yeah, okay, I don't need a gun. Good call. Showtime. So I made them watch while I broke their dad's... Ah, oh, shit. Walk away, or the phrase dead-end job gets literal. I don't have much- We don't want your money, just his. Get out of here. You done fucked up. I've been getting that a lot lately. Where's the safe? If you're lucky, the cops will get to you before my people. <laughs> nice left. Been practicing. I can tell. Safe's back here. This guy had his password be a bunch of fives. Pick it up, Eli. I'm just saying, he could have at least made his work for it. Same plan as last time. Eli, Kev, pretend traffic laws matter and get the money home. Nina and I will split up and give the cops the runaround. Cool, let me get the McGillicuddy. No! Oh. Try to keep up this time. Yeah, yeah. See you at the switch. Time to beat it before the cops show up. Life is full of adversity and challenges. But oh, fuck no. I'm monitoring the police scanner. They just responded to the call. Cops are now en route to the painting place. Sounds like they're out in force. Crap. I had time for a train. Guys, I got cops on my ass. Nina, don't wait for me. I gotta lose these guys. Try sideswiping them. It always works for me. Just let them get alongside you, and then bam, send them into a ditch. Gotta speed up. You'll do more damage the faster you go. The best hit comes from full side-to-side -side contact. I'm not going fast enough to do any damage. <laughs> Guess I won. Ha! <laughs> that took care of them. How's everyone else? Eli and I made it home with the money. You ready for karaoke? Start warming up those voices. Nina, where you at? Just changed cars and headed home. Good. Headed to my switch car now. It was safe and sound at the junkyard a minute ago. That's pretty deep in Pantero's territory. Did you tell your gang you did that? Are you kidding me? If Sergio knew we were running a job on his turf, he would have taken a 90% cut. 90%? Good God. The man's either a monster or a capitalist genius. What? what the fuck did you assholes do to my getaway car? Ain't your car if it's on our turf. Now you're gonna pay for parking. Damn. The things I do to pay my rent. Take over! 
today. I needed that fucking car. Perfect hit. I don't see him. You can't fight back against us. Problem. Love Clint Carroll strapped my switch car. Hey, what? Bigger problem. Police picked up that firefight at the junkyard. They're heading your way. Grab a bike and head off-road. I'll pick you up in the desert. Damn. Sounds like no karaoke tonight. Every fucking time, man. I'm on my way. There's a trail that goes between the mesas. I'll meet you on the other side. Got it. Do I want to know what happened to the Panteros who stripped your car? Sorry, Nina. Self-defense. Fuck, I didn't want that to happen. Let's hope Sergio never finds out it was us. I've got cops up the ass. I'll pick you up on the other side of the bridge. Oh! You didn't want to risk your car. I said I didn't want to risk it for rent. I'd risk anything for you, dummies. So, is this how it's gonna be every time we have to pay rent? I thought that went great. Yeah, okay. Maybe I can go back to running my old side hustles for extra cash? Don't worry. We'll figure it out. This town is full of opportunities. If you know where to look. Glad you made it home safe. We have to get better at this rent thing or we'll never get to do karaoke again. Also, we'll get evicted. Nina said you might go back to some of your old side hustles. I have some friends who might need work done in your area of expertise. When you say friends, do you mean friends, friends, or special friends? All my friends are special. I'll put their info on your map. I think you'll really like them. I'll like them fine as long as their money's good. Thanks, Kev.
I'm a great driver. I know. I saw your wanted post. Having trouble with Los Panteros? Boy, am I. Those assholes keep scaring away my customers. I need an example made out of them. I'll take care of them for you. That'd be mighty helpful. Left you a little present to help you out. Our business, not yours. I told you not to put that shit in your gas tank, home. Oh, this ain't cheering me up. Just what I wanted. Stay the hell out of Pantero's business. Surprise, surprise. Monster truck. I want you to smash those some bitches with it. You can find them tearing around the desert nearby. I want my money back. Yeah, I tried that place, but I didn't like the food. I. they are. out driving around God knows where, so you'll need to lure her out. Smashing up her shit should do the trick. She manages the Pantero's gym over in Smelterville.
Those Pantero's cars are all so nice and shiny. Didn't even feel that one. Oh! Guess I won. Those cars looked expensive. That should drive out Louisa. Pantero's problem. Thanks a million. Now I can get my business back on track. 